Change of venue for our Tea Time Tuesdays. We're taking it outside for a few summer days here on Tuesdays. And today I'm feeling like an extra rule breaker because although this is Tea Time Tuesday, today it's gonna be Latte Tuesday because it's just one of those days. And a vanilla latte is delicious. And since I don't have a tea bag that comes out of my vanilla latte, I'm just gonna share with you one of my favorite quotes. Roosevelt? I think it was Roosevelt. Comparison is the thief of joy. Comparison is the thief of joy. And, oof, it's an emotional Latte Tuesday for me. Um, just where I'm at today. I've been doing this lately. I have been comparing my no, comparison the thief of joy, we often think about judging or comparing ourselves with others. And one of the biggest traps of comparison could be you comparing yourself to the you from 10 years ago, or you comparing yourself to the you that you desire to be but feel like there's a gap. And um, that's what I've been up to lately. A little bit of self-comparison. And I have a story that, oh, maybe five, eight years ago, things were just much easier. Work was easier, living was easier, money was easier, and um, that very well could be illusion. I might be <laughs> recalling that incorrectly, yet I'm using it as a benchmark, and I'm thiefing my current joy when I compare to the illusion of eight years ago, which isn't real and might be skewed. And this is a big juicy one. Consider how are you comparing yourself to your former self, to your younger self? How are you comparing the self that you know, as if I'm talking about different selves, but the, the future self that there are goals and targets to which you are moving, yet not yet there. And do we use that comparison as a form of punishment for ourselves in some way? Um, I invite you to knock it off. That is my coaching advice for you today. Simply knock it off. <laughs> comparison is the thief of joy. Be present with what you have right now and find the gratitude for that while you continue to make the changes you desire. Let me know about this one. This one feels pretty juicy and there's a lot of ways you can play with this quote, comparison is the thief of joy, um, especially when it's in the form of judgment. All right, my sweet friends, until our next Tuesday for tea or latte or whiskey, I don't know. I don't know what's going to happen. I'll see you soon. Thanks for playing. Come join us. Let go. Live now. Mm -hmm.